Hi, we're the Salem's and we're on a cruise in the Bahamas. And this is what we're doing right now. There's an adult superstore across the street. Yeah, and uh, they have uh, the biggest selection and the lowest prices. Last night, I put a GoPro on this window to get a time lapse. And instead of putting it in time lapse mode, it was in single photo mode. So when I pushed the record button, it just took one picture of the street and the adult superstore across the street. Good job, Michael. You're the best vlogger. Listen. <laughs> I'm, I'm sure, I'm sure even Spielberg at one time was just like, oops, I only got one frame. I wonder what the biggest mistake Steven Spielberg has ever made is. I assume we will drive together all the way through Eastern California. Oh yeah, so, yeah, yeah, there's that long stretch, yeah. My only question at this point is whether that in and out down the street is open. We're at Carl's Jr. again, Todd's favorite place. Uh, I ordered a burger that has uh, noino on. Dude, check out this U-Haul. Really that cop though is just having a jolly old time. a woman running on the side of the road. That was weird. Yeah. We made it. We made it to California. Whew! I made it. You uh, got pants? I got pants? You got, you got pants? I got shorts. Hello? Hello. Hello. Where's the other criminal? Oh my god! Hi! Merry Christmas! Merry Christmas! I didn't expect you. Was I... Oh, that's not a time. What time is it? I think my watch died. Oh no, it's uh, 1.50. Yeah. 1.50. Well, I honestly thought there'd be a lot of traffic. There's some cookies right here. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Is it slow motion? No. Mm. <laughs> I can make it slow motion though. So our first order of business is coming to Costco to get things. Uh, vodka. <laughs> vodka and limes, apparently. Later we're going to the airport to pick up Nicole, who's flying in from Missoula today. Later than that, Caitlin is flying in from Florida, so I'm gonna go pick her up. I don't see any... Um, Samples? Samples. We're, all, we're not on the food side yet. Mm, I see a sample. No, they're just they're just self-serving. Oh, uh, that's not a sample. Does whiskey have an E in it normally? So I looked this up recently. Normally, I think it's American whiskeys have the E, and then Scotch whiskeys do not. But then like both of these Japanese ones have different spelling. So both correct. I like that the bottle magnifies the text on the other side. Oh. I can't read it, but yeah, it's I don't cool. Know what it says. This aisle right here, the frozen food aisle. This is my childhood. Marie Callender's pot pies? Dang. Got the pizzas, dinosaur chicken nuggets. How do you tell what, what's a good bag of limes? Yeah, I don't know. This one's got like some weird color action. What does that mean? There are just so many people here. I think you're gonna let, I'm gonna okay. watch you put it in your mouth. And I want to see you go, oh my god, I am mistaken. Did you get some with any hummus on it? I did. Okay. <laughs> I mean, it, it tastes like hummus. Does it taste like chickpeas? It's, it's mostly the texture that I'm not into. Are you a texture guy? Yeah. All right. Thank I'll, you. I'll finish you it if you I'll want. I'll give you that. Have a Merry Christmas. You Thank too. You. I don't understand why all beef jerky is so sugary. It doesn't make sense. I don't know what this means. Oh wait. When it's busy. Okay, yes. You're supposed to go this way. Okay. You should go first though. That was $145? Oh, the alcohol. Dang. I like your watch. Oh, thank you. When you have a nice boyfriend, that's what happens. There you go. That's what happens. <laughs> cool. I gotta you. get me a nice boyfriend. <laughs> it's all uh, stormy now. It's getting gray. Yeah. It's not too cold for a hot dog though. Which one are we rolling? The six? 20. The 20. This one. That one. Yeah. 14. You go first. Okay. So that means I have the last turn. So I put, put this down, down and then I draw three of yeah. these. Yeah. This is the game of evolution. The beginning. I've never played this before. Do this first. This 
species as a whole takes yeah, three yeah, food. Yeah. yeah. This species as a whole right now can consume four food. You already need these two food to feed this one. So you're not going to be able to max out this. Does that make sense? I think so. But then everything survives. It's just you didn't maximize the fat tissue this turn. Okay. But it does survive. But I didn't survives. maximize the fat tissue this turn. Oh, sh**. What's the average playtime of one game of this? 30 minutes tops. 30 minutes. <clears throat> Oh, does it say tops? No, <laughs> but it's on the top of the box. <laughs> oh, this is true. So yeah. I need a new specione. A specione. A specione. A specione. Specione. A specione. I'd like the large specione. I'd like to order one hand tossed specione. <laughs> <laughs> All right, baby. Nocturnal burrowing carnival. Okay. okay. Yeah, I create a new spachone. A new spachone. Hey, Looks can I like get a deep dish spachone? Ryan, you look like you've had some alcohol to drink. Yeah. <laughs> I do get red. Super in the face. red. I also get splotchily red almost everywhere on my body. Almost. <laughs> Tell me more. <laughs> Sometimes when I drink enough, my arm gets a little splotchy. Sometimes my calves. Oh my. My uh, <laughs> upper chest. <laughs> yes. uh, well, I think it's your turn. Yeah, why don't you go ahead and take your turn? <laughs> you freaking hand toss, Spachoni. <laughs> what are you, some kind of hand toss, Spachoni? <laughs> so these don't count, but no, these yeah, do? All of them count. Oh, all of this okay. counts. All your cards count, baby. Okay. All the cards count, baby. Thanks, yeah. Spachoni. Spachoni. <laughs> yeah. Some kind of spachone spachone. over here. Oh. 61. 59. 64. Oh, oh. <laughs> I knew I should have attacked your spachones more. Yeah. <laughs> I just found out that Caitlin's flight is delayed by an hour, so she's getting in at midnight 30. Later than I was hoping to be awake this evening. Sometimes for friends, you gotta do them a solid. We got Nicole, that's her hair right there. Yeah. We got Nicole and brought her back and now uh, it's raining quite considerably just as I have to go pick up Caitlin from the airport. A silly situation for one in the morning. Airports are busy around Christmas. How was your cruise? It was nice. It was warm. Yesterday it was kind of rainy, but it was still nice. I went to an island called Coco Cay in the Bahamas. That was probably my favorite part. Was this your first cruise? It was my first cruise. How did you feel about cruising in general? It was whatever. <laughs> it was whatever. But I felt like we were waiting around a lot for things because we were either waiting for events on the cruise to happen or we were waiting for food to open or we were waiting in line to get off the ship. So it just felt like there was a lot of waiting. I don't know if that's a thing for cruises normally or if it was just this cruise. What uh, cruise line was it? Royal Caribbean. All of the cruises that I've been on, except for one, have been Royal Caribbean. And I don't recall a lot of waiting. I, I really liked going to all the different ports and stuff and getting off and you get to watch the sunset and the sunrise. It was really pretty to just be on the ocean. But I saw some sharks. You saw some sharks. I saw some sharks. This one guy was feeding a shark off the end of his boat right by the docks. Uh, there was a shark swimming on one of the islands that we, not on the island, but we just were walking swimming on the, on the sand. We were walking on the beach and it was just right offshore from the island. We were watching it swim and circle around this school of fish. My dad went parasailing and my brother went parasailing. I should have gone parasailing. I think I could have gone, but I also didn't want to just leave my mom by herself, so. We went to Nassau. Nassau? Nassau. That's different than NASA. <laughs> yeah, mm -hmm. but that place was just stressful, I found. 
because it was basically just a big tourist trap. There were a bunch of people with their shops set up and waiting for you to get off of the cruise ship and asking you if you want to go on a cruise and if you want to buy this thing and like putting bracelets on your wrist and being yeah, like, here, you should buy it. Of... Thanks for picking me up at one in the morning. Yeah. We're probably not going to make it to In-N-Out. That's okay. <laughs> there are more days to go to In-N-Out. <laughs>